Hey, check this out. I went ahead and uh, I was creating this aerial and I brought in some uh, shape files through AutoCAD Civil 3D, which has the map uh, component uh, with it. And what I did is, and I'll, sh I'll show you real quick, if you do um, on your command line type in map W space and turn it turn it on you get this task pane and this is where you can connect to all of your shape files through your data connections and I've already connected to this wetland so if I turn this wetland on you'll see that I get some um, some wetland information here but I want to stylize that so that it is transparent and shows the aerial coming through it so if I go to my styles tab and uh, simply change the style of this to um, say 50% transparent and say OK. Um, it shows some transparency, which is really cool. But the problem I'm having, or was having, is that when I plot this, no matter what, um, even when I did a plot and I did a preview, um, the preview would show the transparency. Uh, being applied, but if I plotted um, the drawing, this is this is what it ended up looking like. So even though my transparency was set, my plot this is a, a, in uh, Adobe and uh, or a PDF, and my PDF was still showing up with no transparency, and that really puzzled me because why would they give you the transparency ability? without uh, uh, being able to um, plot that way. So um, what I did is I went ahead and um, did a little bit of research and found out that there is this, um, this toggle or this va variable that uh, you, can, you can type in on your command line and it is uh, simply plot transparency override. So when you enter that in, you get this enter new value, and it's just a toggle, and I'm going to put enter the two value. So now when you enter the two value, your transparency will plot properly, and uh, I have a PDF that shows that. Uh, this is a, a PDF that I had done, and now the transparency is showing up. Really cool. Have any, uh, rate this video, subscribe to my channel. And I will uh, see you next time.